Podcast clips are raking in millions of views on YouTube. YouTube Shorts has an average RPM of 5 cents. If you pull off 10 million Shorts views per month, you can make $500. Let's review the most viewed short in this channel. Some guy was talking about how Putin and Biden shook hands and then how Putin looked away. Now, let's compare it to the YouTube short I created with AI. One of the key distinctions I, I tell my students to make, because it's not talked about a lot with simulation theory, is what I call the NPC versus the RPG versions of simulation theory. As you can see, it has captions and B-rolls, just like the viral video. This is the tool I use to make this. It's called Vizard AI. It turns long videos into 10 plus short viral clips. Its latest feature, Spark, lets you pick specific scenes using custom prompts, making it easier and faster to create the clips you need. The link to this tool is in the description, so go click it and sign up. As you can see here, I've already tested out this tool with a few podcasts. When you click Create Project, you'll see four options. You can choose to upload from link, upload a local file, record a video, or import from Zoom. I'll go with the link. First up, let's look for a podcast. But we need to be strategic if we want to start raking in views in our first few uploads. Let's look for podcasts that people love to watch. According to Rufonic.com, these are the top podcasts in USA. Let's focus more on the top three podcasts. The Joe Rogan Experience. This podcast appeals to young adult males with an interest in comedy, current events, politics, and conspiracy theories. The Diary of a CEO. This podcast is aimed at entrepreneurs seeking inspiration, motivation, and practical business advice. The Pat McAfee Show. This podcast is for sports fans, especially football enthusiasts who enjoy news, analysis, and commentary. You have to decide who your target audience will be before picking your podcast. Of course, you can mix up clips from different podcasts if you want, but think of the long run. Niching down helps you form stronger connections with your audience, allowing you to earn beyond just ad revenue. Sponsors value creators with a well-defined target audience, making them more likely to collaborate with you. For this example, I want to make shorts that target business-minded people, so I'll go with the diary of a CEO. Let's find a podcast from the channel and copy the URL. Go back to Vizard and paste it. Select your upload resolution, then select the podcast language, then click Upload. Here you have two options. If you want AI to pick the clips for you, then select the first option. But if you want to manually pick the clips, go with the second choice. I'll go with the AI option. Here you can choose between these features. We will test out both features on the same podcast video starting with the one-click viral shorts. Choose the aspect ratio, length, and style. Adding keywords is optional, but you can use this if you want to clip specific topics. Our AI is now working on the clips, but we can fast forward this process. The best thing about the viral clips option is this viral score feature. It rates the whole clip, plus it gives you an overview of the clip topic. But here's another thing I like about this tool. It already generated a viral title and the keywords. So you can literally just pick a clip export it, then copy the AI-generated title and keywords. But you can customize the clip as well by clicking Edit. Here's the longer transcript of the clip. It's so easy to edit your clip. You just highlight the parts you want to add or remove, then it will automatically edit the clip. You can customize the subtitle style here as well. You can also add B-roll. They have this beta feature called AI B-rolls. Let's test it. Now, let's export this clip and test out the other feature. So, I uploaded the same video, but this time I'll use Spark 1.0. The best thing about this feature is that you can select specific topics you want to clip out by simply entering a prompt. I'd like to highlight the lessons, advice, tips, and quotes. You can also select the clip length, but I'll go with the default. Then let's click Get AI Clips to proceed. As you can see, the clips still have the original resolution. We got the topics we asked for, and on the side you can still see the title and overview of each clips, so let's pick one and edit it. Let's change the aspect ratio to 9 by 16, and make sure to enable auto reframe before applying the changes. Now, let's customize the subtitles. Then, let's add B-rolls. 
Now we can export the clip. Here's the result. There are four things that make memory stick. And this is after 25 or 30 years studying the hippocampus and, and how memories work. Number one is obvious, repetition. Okay. You, you remember things with repetition. This tool is perfect if you have a podcast, as it will save you tons of time. I attached a link in the description. You can try out this tool for free, but you can only export videos in 720 pixels. But if you don't mind pixels and watermarks, then the free version is totally good to use. If you want to export 4K videos with no watermark, you have to upgrade to the creator plan. One of the best things I like about upgrading to the creator plan is that I can schedule my clips to auto post by connecting it to my social media account. I joined their program, so you can get a 5% discount when you use my link and apply the code in the description. I hope you find this video helpful. See you in the next video.